Magic Johnson, a five-time NBA champion and one of the most revered figures in basketball history, recently took a strong stance in response to comments made by Minnesota Timberwolves star Anthony Edwards. The 23-year-old Edwards, who has quickly become one of the league's most promising young players, stirred controversy with his remarks about the skill level of players from previous generations. In an interview with the asterisk Wall Street Journal, Edwards was asked to compare the current state of the NBA with that of older generations. His response was bold and somewhat dismissive. I didn't watch it back in the day so I can't speak on it, Edwards said. They say it was tougher back then than it is now, but I don't think anybody had skill back then. Michael Jordan was the only one that really had skill, you know what I mean. So that's why when they saw Kobe, Bryant, they were like, oh, my god, but now everybody has skill. These comments did not sit well with Magic Johnson, who has long been considered one of the most skilled players in the history of the game. Johnson, who was attending an event at Yamava Resort and Casino in San Bernardino County, was asked by ESPN's Stephen A. Smith to respond to Edwards' statement. In typical Magic Johnson fashion, he addressed the issue with a mix of confidence and subtlety, but his message was clear. I don't never respond to a guy that's never won a championship, Johnson said, pointedly referencing Edwards' lack of a championship title. While Johnson's response included a double negative, his intention was unmistakable. He was effectively dismissing the opinions of a young player who, in his view, had not yet earned the right to make such sweeping judgments. Johnson, who won his first NBA title as a rookie with the Los Angeles Lakers in 1980 and added four more championships over the next eight years, went on to underscore Edwards' limited experience in winning at the highest levels. There's not nothing to really say, Johnson continued. He didn't win a college championship. I don't know if he even won a high school championship. To further emphasize his point, Johnson contrasted Edwards' achievements with his own. By the time Johnson was 23, the same age as Edwards, he had already won a high school state championship with Everett High in Michigan, an NCAA championship with Michigan State in 1979, and two NBA titles. Edwards, on the other hand, while having led his high school team, Holy Spirit Preparatory School in Atlanta, to a state championship in 2018, has yet to achieve similar success at the professional or collegiate level. He did, however, secure a gold medal with the U.S. national team at the Paris Olympics earlier this year. Johnson's remarks also hinted at another aspect of Edwards' comments that might have irked him. Edwards had said, I don't know too many guys who won a championship super young, besides Kobe, seemingly unaware that Johnson won his first NBA title in his rookie year. The implication that young players rarely achieve championship success early in their careers clearly overlooked Johnson's own accomplishments, further fueling the Lakers legend's response. Magic Johnson's career is a testament to his extraordinary skill and success. In addition to his five NBA championships, he also won a gold medal at the 1992 Barcelona Olympics as a member of the Dream Team, the first U.S. Olympic basketball team to feature NBA players. Moreover, Johnson has continued to rack up championships in his post-playing career as a partial owner of several Los Angeles sports teams, including the Dodgers, LAFC, and the Sparks, bringing his total number of championships as an owner and player to eight. Johnson was not the only NBA legend to take issue with Edwards' comments. Isaiah Thomas, a Hall of Famer and two-time NBA champion with the Detroit Pistons, also expressed his disagreement. Thomas, who was known for his exceptional skills as a point guard, took to social media to challenge the notion that old-school players lacked skill. He reposted Edwards' quote on X, formerly Twitter, and wrote, Propaganda works, so be careful what you choose to believe. Thomas further elaborated on his stance by highlighting the differences in the way the game is played today, particularly with the increased emphasis on the three-point shot. The only skill, emphasized, more is the three-point shot, creating the illusion that the athlete and skills have magically evolved into another athletic species, Thomas wrote in another post. He also pointed out that changes in the rules, such as the prohibition of hand-checking, have made the game appear faster and have benefited modern players in ways that make direct comparisons with past generations difficult. In sum, both Magic Johnson and Isaiah Thomas were quick to defend the legacy of their era, pushing back against the narrative that today's players are significantly more skilled than those who came before. Their responses highlight the deep pride and respect they have for the game and the players who helped shape it into what it is today.